I was thinking to myself as I was polishing my gun that will eventually end my life that, you know, I haven't watched a Burbank cartoon in quite a while. And then I said, hey, why the hell not? Oh, Burbank, I praise your ineptitudes. And I would go further with that, but all I need to do is see that wizard and it all comes back to me. I love Melvin the Moron. Yeah, yeah, I bet his name's Merlin or something like that, but honestly, fuck him and his Doctor Strange amulet. Fucking thing sucks! So this time around out of the Princess 10-pack, I decided to go with the Little Mermaid. You can only imagine what kind of padding I'm gonna get after sitting through Goldilocks and the Three Bears and Hansel and Gretel. Oh, who gives a shit? Let's just get on with it. Roll that beautiful bean fuck footage! Hans Christian was 14 when he left home to seek fame and fortune in Copenhagen. Ooh, looks like Melvin picked up a book or two. He had written over 150 fairy tales to be enjoyed just as they were when they were first written. Thank God they're in the public domain to exploit or, I mean, retell. Oh, fancy. Mario 64 would be proud. There, Cardonia. Faber. What kind of micro-nations build castles that take up 75% of the land they have? Are they just egomaniacs? A fabulous place called the Mudville Kingdom. The Mudville Kingdom, huh? That name makes Cincinnati sound good. <laughs> Ask me, give it Was this recorded in a toilet tank? Who's a pretty boy, bud? I have a new object of hate. I don't even know its name, but only if it dies will I know joy again. Gotta go up, Melinda. So out of curiosity, I googled how deep a sea otter can go, and it turns out they can get all the way down to 250 feet. Wouldn't Mudville be just, oh, I don't know, a little bit deeper than that? Or does not Peanut Otter here have Michael Phelps' lung capacity? The island of Cardonia, where the king's son, Prince William, has just made a startling announcement to his father. That they're in a shitty cartoon? I'm terribly sorry, Papa. I'm just sorry. You can't mean that. No. Oh, oh, oh. Toby. Please replay that. Peace between Cardonia and Faber after a hundred years of war. One hundred years of looking pussy? And I'm talking about cats, because that is how cats do. Cockle for the pathetic poor of Faber. One for the stupid starving. And one for the deplorable dying. Hell, I like her. She gives out more money than Jeff Bezos. For the sake of Cardonia, I must marry Princess Clarissa, even if she makes me unhappy for the rest of my life. Sounds like your average marriage. Very well, Papa. I will marry Princess Clarissa, for you and for the good of all Cardonia. All three of them. Not even six minutes in and we have recycled animation. That might be a new non-dingo record. Miranda was just a few days from her ascension. Ascension? Is she becoming a deity? Please tell me this isn't real. Chug it in the ocean, that's the caper. Chug it in the ocean, that's the caper. Chug it in the ocean, that's the caper. Hardy, hardy, har. Move over, Billie Eilish. You've got competition. They keep polluting our beautiful kingdom. You know, wallpaper emotes better. Telling how beautiful the Merfolk Kingdom is and shame them so they'll never pollute our world again. Even if you got Al Gore's attention, that plan won't work. Around the human world, please hear my song to you. No. That's brown instead of blue. Well, he's dead. The rubbish that you carelessly ring on us from above. 
Oh, I feel like I'm repeating myself from the last review. If you can't animate or write a story, what in the name of Aquaman scaly ass are you doing writing songs? Did you just hear that shitty song? Rebecca Black sings better. Maybe even the Olsons. Pose new taxes on the people as I ordered? Oh yes, sire. Bread tax, water tax, and uh, fresh air tax. How much revenue can you get from imaginary people? Peace. <laughs> what a joke. Wait till I get my hands on King David's. My inner joy is restored! The waterlogged rat bastard is dead! What in the ocean is that? It's a fucking whale! Have you never seen one before? How many plastic six-pack rings do you have to eat to be this stupid? Didn't even look, I mean it could've killed me! That was my hope. I can't tell if this is good storytelling or lazy animating. Dum dum da da! Dum dum da da! She has daisy tits! You know, that's the first time I've said that phrase and felt disgust! Thanks, Burbank! Now I'll never be able to look at Nintendo princesses the same again! Only in this for the money. I'd order in a black dress if I were you. I'm Shit. Happy May Day to you, Miranda! Yeah! Don't do that! Happy May Day, dear Miranda! <laughs> there will be no interspecies erotica, thank you very much! Besides, if you want that, go watch Saber Spark. Congratulations on reaching your age of ascent, my girl! And my felicitations! Why does the whale sound like Dr. Claw? It was as though she was leaving home to embark on a long journey. She's going up 15 feet to breach in a pool? Who cares? You've become the man I always hoped my son would be. Considering I'm the one who put you in this mess. Seasick? I'll get the crew to adjust the ballast. You get seasick sailing 500 feet? Well, damn! Please shit on her, please shit on her, please shit on her. That's the caper, heave ho the ballast! Oh no! What? It's only rocks, not last night's dinner. Did I leave the iron on? Wonderful thing, the ocean. Travel on it, eat from it, even dump your garbage in it. Yes, eating and shitting in the same place sounds grand. William! Best voice acting in the movie right here. Christ, the dinghy goes faster than the ship! They could have just rode their boat over there! Yeah, that shit don't work that way. And you have breath! It stinks. I will give you a, a mermaid's first kiss. To heal you. Uh, so when did this become a thing? Does she possess the same abilities as Mipha from Breath of the Wild? Man, talk about taking your liberties. Well, this is a meeting of the minds. <laughs> I take back what I said about the dog's voice acting.
That's a running joke I can appreciate. William, come in here for a moment, will you? What a lovely name! Wow! How horny are you? Are you about to start laying your eggs in the hope that he's going to spread his baby batter across them? Get a grip, girl! Dear God, not the shitty song again. Oh, please end it! Surely it was the most beautiful place. Yes, of course. It, it all took my breath away. And yet, you're still here. The young human man I saved. Every time I close my eyes, I see his face. That sounds like a living hell. I don't know what I expected. Sea Witch? Are you there? You know, I just realized something. This is the same sleepy voice actor that played Goldilocks, except I think for this session they gave her cocaine. She sounds a hell of a lot livelier. Yes, Miss Miranda. I am here. Jesus jumped up Christ! Take it off the screen before my face melts like it's Raiders of the Lost Ark! A human! <laughs> Why does Gonzo the Stingray have boobs? Of course I can do it! I'll give you legs! Got a potion for that, but uh, I'm old enough! Yeah, that's a phrase that sounds super creepy in a kid's cartoon. You won't be able to speak. No. For a whole year! Until the potion wears off. You know, that sounds more like an improvement. I mean, this is a year. Disney only gave him three days. In the book, it's until the guy gets married, but when you step, it feels like you're stepping on knives, so... Yeah, this sounds great! For the last time, I'm begging you, please, uh. don't do it, Moanda! Shut up, baby bear! Why haven't you drowned yet? Hey, she got clothes. Nice perk to this deal. The mermaid who saved me. Surely it can't be. Huh. Billy ain't as dumb as I thought he was. Well, this is wrapped up pretty quick. You big off off! I'm sure that's an insult somewhere. Wanna tell me all about it, Miranda? Sick burn! Another one of those and you'll be serving filet of fish I'll never see her again. But I'll never forget her. Ever. Like I said, the voice actor's talent really shines through here. Will somebody say something? Not sure why I'm telling you this. I can't speak to anyone else. I, I must go. Dude, we all get awkward boners. I got 10 minutes left in this movie and I'm going through a training wheel scene right now? Fuck, I bet this ending is gonna be rushed. And this was established when? Well, in the fairy tale, she does lose her voice, but she becomes a very enchanting dancer. Well, that would be something to mention in this movie, maybe. Wonder why they couldn't have time to do that. Oh wait, daisy tits and dog slapping took all the precedence. I'm sorry. Filthy mermits off that cake! <sighs> Rude much? You know that Prince William chap I'm going to be married to? For a little while. Hmm, a very little while, Clarissa. Yeah. Clarissa, please don't explain it all. He's a dead man.
and says his stupid father. I'm only 50% on board with this plan. Upon learning King Fossil's murderous plan, Miranda knew she must find William and his father to warn them. Are there no guards in this seaside shit shack? How I wish you could talk. How I wish you could animate. Are they all mute now? They don't care about us. We shouldn't care about them. How is she making noises? Or is that not considered vocal? Really? Fucking really? She just magically turned into Aquaman all of a sudden? God damn it. Fuck this Deus Ex King Triton bullshit! It always ends in tears when merfolk try to be human! I could say the same thing when I see you on screen, lady. Sorry, girls. I'll need fresh <laughs> mermaids here. Lots of it. Oh no, they're going to become Sinead O'Connor. A fate worse than death. Well, this music is oddly appropriate. I have seen shit that'll turn you white. Do any among you have any reason to say this man and this woman should not be joined in holy wedlock? Oh! Oh! Right there with you, dog. Oh no, here we go again. She's gonna grow another head. Please, movie, don't do me any favors. Perhaps you've heard of my rights that police tend to forget to say. I'm very popular right now. Was this church built with a PS1 engine? I am your god now. Bring me your virgins. A human prince kisses you. Well, that'll kill a boner. Here's to better times ahead. Not with that haircut, there won't. At least as far as I'm concerned. And the day is saved thanks to... King Cubal? Oh my god, I am so jealous of her hair! How can mine be just like that? People from the human world, please hear my song to you. Oh dear god, the song of pain returns! And we wrap up with a montage of recycled animation. Talk about a green and environmentally friendly cartoon. Well, that was a wonderful retelling of The Little Mermaid. Yeah, if you lived at the bottom of the ocean, you never heard a story before. And just to be a little bit original, not that they should have been, they decided to crowbar an environmental message and then sprinkle it with a shitty song that's so bad it would make your ears bleed and the neighborhood dogs pine for death. Then the animation is so cheap, not even Dollar Tree would sell that shit. Honest to God, if Burbank cut any more corners with this project, that shit would be round. God. Now if you'll excuse me, I gotta take my chicken to the sea and then plant it into my new porcelain aquarium. Under the sea. Wish I could be under the sea. Cause darling, it is better down where it's wetter. Oh, get the gun. I'm gonna get with this, especially after sitting through Hansel and Gretel. You motherfucker. Or lazy. <laughs> Thanks, Burbank! Now I'll never be able to look at Disney. Or
Now I'll never be able to look at Nintendo princes the same again. Princesses. Uh, princes. Fuck! Is this ending gonna be rushed? Yeah, it will. Because that's what the fuck's gonna happen. <laughs>